Scholz is the first European leader to visit China after the 20th National Congress of the CPC. Scholz's visit will further enhance the mutual understanding and trust between the two sides and deepen cooperation in various fields and gives the two sides an opportunity to plan for the growth of bilateral ties going forward. German Chancellor Scholz said that Germany firmly supports trade liberalization and economic globalization. Germany is also willing to discuss with China topics where the two sides had different perspectives. The two leaders also exchanged views on the Ukraine crisis. It has been clear from this meeting that China and Germany expressed many common views. For example, they both emphasized increasing mutual understanding and trust, adhering to economic globalization, prompting practical cooperation, adhering to dialogue and consultation, opposing block confrontation, and stepping up coordination and cooperation in international affairs. Sols again made clear his opposition to decoupling. China and Germany are influential forces in Asia and Europe respectively. Their consensus not only meets the fundamental interest of both sides but is also essential to the stability of the global economy and security. China on the other hand is willing to strengthen cooperation with Germany in trade and investment, manufacturing, vaccines and other major fields, push for the creation of a collaborative mechanism for handling climate changes and increase direct flights between the two countries to facilitate people-to-people -people exchanges. Solzhen's China visit could also prompt some of his European peers to shift toward a more pragmatic approach in engaging with China. Thanks for watching the video.